Hello, it's Jason Payne with JDP Realty Group, a Cole Banker, Dean Hop Realtors. Well, today I'm at Chavano Highlands in the north central part of the San Antonio area. Beautiful community, kind of an upscale neighborhood. And our feature builder is going to be Joffet. Let's go check him out. All right, this is Joffet's model home. It is a beautiful four bedroom, just over 3,000 square foot home. And uh, this is a gorgeous community, and the location's really key. We are right off of 1604 on the other side of Chavano Park area. Um, if you look on a map, you'll see Camp Bullis, where the road is that goes from Camp Bullis to 1604. That's where this community is off of. Great schools here and some beautiful builders in this community. Let's go check out. Well, let's go and walk up here and check out this uh, little courtyard thing they have set up. You don't see uh, this from too many different builders, but a uh, neat little courtyard. Kind of digging it. All right, let's check out the inside of this beautiful house. Loving the front door. Eight foot doors are standard with Joffit. And this is kind of unique, no door handle. Just this little spot you have to push. Now, with the same standard caveat, I have to put on every model home tour that the builder, Joffet in this case, has put every bell and whistle into this house just to showcase what they can do. Right off front, you do have your formal dining room space. And this is normally a utility closet, which they've converted to a wine room. Let me get some light on to kind of show you what that looks like. Maybe. You can see it in there. But uh, also showing you off what's up front here. Now most builders nowadays are putting kind of a flex room in it where you can have it be in an office, game room, movie room, whatever type of room you want to have it. And this is Joffet's. So good size for pretty much anything you want it to be. And almost missed the powder room right up front. Beautifully done. Now you do have a bedroom right here. This is the perfect place for, if you got a long-term guest um, or they have their own ensuite, they got plenty of space with their own private bath. So someone can get completely ready in the morning and look how they got a towel going all the way up. Love that touch. So you can get yourself completely ready in the morning before you ever present yourself to the world. Now, the sales rep is using this bedroom up front as her office. But well, I still wanna showcase, show you what this looks like. This would actually be the third bay of the garage. Okay, I was gonna say, it's like, I know this is a four bedroom house and I'm like, I'm counting five. So this would have a garage that kind of pulls into yes. this uh, right here. And I love that. I've seen that in a couple of other builders. So thank you for letting me know that because I got a lot of people wanting to convert that extra garage into like a weight room or something yeah, else. Absolutely. All right, let's go check out the main living space because it is beautiful. All right, when you come in, you notice the big, tall A-frame ceilings in here with the beams. They do have the fireplace in the corner, which, like I said, it's my own personal preference. I like it kind of tucked away in the corner because if you must have a fireplace, you can do that and still have room for your TV and entertainment area on the main wall. But let's take a look at this main living space something in my boot all right beautiful kitchen big big island absolutely love it you do have your built-in oven with a multi-purpose fancy dancy microwave built by Bosch those are nice you can do all sorts of little tricks with that but this is where your other your standard two-car garage is. 
and people are working in there so no need to go inside there but this is your utility room so nice having the sink in there speaking of sinks let's check this one out nice single sink you guys know my views of 50 50 sinks that i think they're just pointless so uh, great views from the sinks in this house you do have a good size breakfast nook area and here's where we've got the two bedrooms in the back of the house i always love seeing how different builders kind of uh decorate the other bedrooms and obviously you can tell we have a star wars theme so very neatly done room check out this bed that's pretty darn cool but it does have what i call a little mini walk-in closet for the kiddos This will be a kind of a Jack and Jill bathroom because each kid will have their own sink. I'm not going to say familiar status, you don't have to have kids to buy this house, but if you did, the kids won't be fighting over who left whose mess on the sink. Shared toilet and the shared bathtub shower combo. There we go, a little better light. And then we'd have the other sink right there. So they'd have the own sink. All right, now, if you thought the Star Wars room was cool, check out this one. What, uh, what do y'all think of that bed? I know my uh, eight-year-old girl, she's been in quite a few of my videos. She would be crawled up in there right now showing off that cool little bed. Very neat. These tall eight foot standard doors by Joffit. All right, this beautiful patio. Let's see if I can remember how to open these doors because there's a little trick to them. I'm gonna have to push it, then pull it. So these doors open all the way up how cool is that yes i know it's going to be loud out there we are in a they are expanding this community right now so we've got some quite a bit of work going on out there but if i can cover the mic see if i'm blocking some of that noise this is the extended deck their normal covered deck kind of goes right where that corner is but because it's a model home they've extended it and I'm sure for a price, you can have it extended too. But nice little fireplace and having extended decks are always nice. All right, let's get out of this noise. So I can find the... There we go, much better. All right, last but not least, let's go check out this owner suite. Plenty sized room. A beautiful tray ceiling up there. Check out this bathroom. All right, we do have a his and her vanity. Beautifully done lights. I really like when they have the lights built into the mirrors like that. And a very good size soaking tub with the privacy glass so they don't sh people can't see all your bits and pieces when you stand up and check out the size of this shower i can open this yes i can 
big inset shower. So this shower is actually cut into the foundation of the house and a beautiful rain shower. And I love how they took this shower and the tile all the way up. Very nicely done. All right, and we have separate closets. I had a client tell me that the, once they had the, a his and her closet, they said they don't ever go back to an individual closet because, well, frankly, guys and a, a husband and wife might have completely different ways that they do their closet. I'm not the neatest closet person and my wife, everything has to have their place. So we do have separate closets because that would drive her nuts. So that's always handy. Beautiful tile work in here. My final panoramic shot of the room. All right, that's gonna wrap up the tour of the model home by Joffit in Chavano Highlands. Absolutely beautiful neighborhood and a great location too, especially if you wanna be close to everything in San Antonio. We're just a couple of blocks from 1604. Blanco is just uh, about two blocks to our east. So really great schools in this community and some beautiful homes. And Joff is a great builder, so you should check him out. And if you found this uh, video informative, make sure you like and subscribe. My contact information is gonna be on the back slide. So if you're looking for a realtor to help you with anything, make sure you give me a call. All right, talk to you soon. Take care now, bye.